How's it going, guys? My name is Vader, and welcome back to Medieval Engineers, where we are back in the in the uh, shadow of Vader Hall up on the mountain top there. So, some of you guys wanted me to build a uh, catapult, and I tried that. I was trying for like an hour just to build a catapult, but it they just they just do not work. P. Ah. Uh, well. So I think we'll come back to the catapults sometime in the future when uh, when, when you can actually make them properly. Uh, what I thought we'd just say is I thought we would continue construction of Vader Hall up on top of the hill. So I think it would be quite nice to have this as like an ongoing uh, ongoing project thing and see how it progresses. I think it looks cool already just to, like a, a room on top of the mountain. I think it looks nice. So what I thought we'd do today, uh, if I can, I'm going to try and fill in the ends of this this thing because this is annoying me having this roof with the open things. Let's just try this now actually. Let's get some of these triangle bits like that. And then if I, maybe, if I do them like this, like if I start, oh god, if I start here and then if I drag it across with control, that's the wrong way. Oh no, it just, oh wait, look, yeah, like that. I want to do that. But so if I, oh shit, if I rotate it around the other way, like this. Yes. Oh no. And now we do this. Oh, go in the right direction. Oh. <gasps> it works. It works. So that's how you do that. And it's kind of a, a roundabout way to do it. But you can get those things in the corner. So now if we do the same on the other side. Oh, why do you keep coming towards me? Okay, like th that. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. Oh, it, it sort of deletes the roof slightly. But that's fine. That's fine. So let's just fill in. The rest of the ends of this roof, I'll just do a sort of a montage thing to do that. Okay, there we go. So we got the ends on Vader Hall. Let's see what this looks like from a distance, actually. That looks pretty fancy, actually, off the top of the hill. I like that. So what I thought we'd do now is, if that's like the main hall of the thing, I thought at this level we'd have a sort of courtyardy thing. So that uh, requires some sort of terraforming to sort of level off this rock here. So um, let's get which tool would it be? It's uh, the this one, the le le blah, 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 terrain auto level tool. So we get that, and uh, with the uh, the square brackets is how you change the material, in case you're wondering. So we change it to stone, and then we want it sort of, um, let's have it about here, and it's probably going to bury those stairs. Let's get rid of those stairs first. Okay, so we want it sort of here. So if we do this, oh my, so that looks <laughs> quite something. Actually, if I don't do that, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that, get rid of that. How do I get off, oh, for fuck's sake? I don't want this thing, go away. So yeah, I didn't actually mean to make it out of stone. Um, I meant to use the auto level tool to level that bit off. And then I was going to make, like, obviously a brick courtyard instead. Okay, let's just leave it like that. So, I want to use the auto level tool to flatten off this bit. Hopefully this is how this works. Oh, I don't think it is, is it? Uh, let's just try this. So if I right click. Nope. If I left click. No, it doesn't do that. Okay, fine. So I want to get one of these big things, probably the the, the big sphere because it's massive. And then I'm just going to level off the top of this mountain to get a nice flat plateau. Okay, so this is looking good. Just use this to get rid of all the mountain. Okay, so now we should have a nice flat bit on which to work. So it's, it's not the most even shape ever and it seems to be a little weird. Oh god, how the hell did that happen? It seems to be a little weird piece there. Let's just fill that in. That looks nice. Sort of. Um, so now we have a sort of big flat area with which you can make some kind of walled courtyard. But it's going to be kind of weirdly shaped walled courtyard. <laughs> we'll get around that. Okay, so I want to make a nice courtyardy type shape. And all the bits, um, just I'm going to make it just use these blocks to sort of round it off to make it nice and square. Sort of just following the, the like natural-ish shape of the mountain, sort of. So yeah, I think if we go here and then we'll come across this way. Oh, maybe if I just somehow fill in all the floor, all the floor that I can so I don't get any of these weird nasty gaps. Let's go in first person so I can do this a bit easier. There we go. So let's just fill in all of these bits. So I have these weird holes in the floor. That's an annoying lump. Oh shit, I need to get rid of that. Okay, I don't know if it's going to be possible to get these bits in the floor. If I can just see the tiniest bit 
of edge, then I can get them in. So let's just try and fill the whole thing in. I may as well have just gotten rid of more mountain bike. It's really hard to terraform in this game. It's really um not precise, and you end up doing the wrong thing every single time. Awesome. So we have our nice stone courtyard. So I'm just going to fence this off with walls. There we go. So now we have our walled courtyard out the front of Vader Hall. But actually, I just realized we need to have some way to get down to the ground. So let's make some more stairs uh, coming out of here. That looks kind of cool. So yeah, let's have some stairs going out there uh, the whole way down the mountain. down got down to the ground here so let's have this as a natural sort of ending point for that flight of stairs we can build the rest of them later we have no need to be going up and down the mountain considering we can fly just for aesthetic purposes so we've got that stairway I think that looks quite cool with a sort of aqueduct design um so now I don't know what else we should build um I don't know let's just maybe beautify the courtyard and then I'll leave it there and you guys can decide what you want to see next So I think today's improvements for Vader Hall are done. We've got our lovely king statue staring you down as you come up the stairs and surrounding him with fire pits make him look nice. I think this is a lovely little courtyard. So yeah, if you guys, uh, whatever you guys want to see me build next, I'd quite like to continue this project to build up our castle on top of the mountain. I think it's pretty cool. But anyway, um, I realise this episode's been a little bit short. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on the workshop and just find someone else who's actually made a working catapult and I'm going to load that up and show you guys how catapults work. Um, this is a replica of the trebuchet from in the trailer. Um, but I don't know if that actually works. Let's try it out. So I believe we attach. Ooh, we attach to this one up here. Oh no, the other way around. We attach this one here. T to this thing here. Like that. Nope, didn't do it. There we go. And we pull it down. Da -da 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 to that looks good. And then we attach this thing to this thing. Yeah! And then, I guess, we just attach this and it fires. Yay! But it doesn't actually fire. Oh, you need to, oh, you need to release it manually. Okay, we're trying this again. So we need to release manually, <laughs> which is not the easiest thing ever. So, I press this thing to detach here. And then I need to fly up and detach that one when it gets near the top. You can do it from some distance, but it is still quite a small piece I have to aim at. So let's try this. So, detach. Ah, uh, ah, uh, T, 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 T. Oh, for fuck's sake, I couldn't aim at it. It's so difficult. That one, fly up. That one, that one. Oh my God, I had it. I, it flashed, but I just could not click it. Okay, we are gonna give this thing one last try. So I wanna be somewhere, I wanna be sort of here so I can press this and that as it goes around. So, one last try. Can we do this? T? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> it's not going to happen. It's it's too tricky. No, I'll give it one more go. I just realized actually I can modify this thing. So if we just get rid of that entirely uh, using... If we get one of these... Yep. And also we need that. So if we do this, if we get rid of that bit there... Oh god, did not like that, did not like that! 
Why? Why would that break? Let's try this again. So, what I was trying to do, if I get rid of this thing here, and instead, stick a bucket on there, which the bucket is the wrong way around, the bucket, like, that? No, no. How do I rotate you? There we go, like that. Um, so then, we pull it down, like this, and now, we get one of these, we put dynamic building on, and we put it in the bowl. Somewhere like that. It's in there! It's in there! Okay, so now, now, this should work. And now, we fire. Oh, oh. So yeah, the catapults in this game do not work all too great as of present. But I think that's one of the things the developers are working because that's one of the things people keep asking for it is catapults. But anyway, that's the stage they're at now pretty much. I guess we could put like a bump stop and it might make it work better. Okay, so I've just added this thing here, so hopefully that should mean it actually like launches the ball when it gets there, or it could just snap it in half. Let's see. Oh, uh, oh, it uh, no, <laughs> no. So yeah, the catapults on this game they don't work all too great as of present, but hopefully that's one of the things that developer uh, developers are going to address soon. But uh, for the meantime, that's about as good as you're gonna get. But anyway. Uh, I think we should probably end this here. So yeah, this has been Medieval Engineers. Hope you guys enjoyed. If there's anything you'd like to see me add on to Vader Hall at the top of the mountain, just let me know and I will build it next time. But anyway, until then, I've been Vader and I'll see you guys later.